In this JavaView online training video, I will be demonstrating different ways to export data and save images. If you acquire an image of JavaView for a figure, there are a number of different ways to export the image. Images of each JavaView subwindow can be saved by going to the File drop-down menu and selecting either Export Image or Save As. Each window arrangement can be saved as a PNG or EPS file. PNG is a raster graphic file format optimised for web pages and presentations. For journal publications, we recommend using the EPS format because it generates high quality graphics. The EPS files can be scaled with no loss in image resolution and the files can be edited in programs such as Adobe Illustrator. When saving an EPS file, you can select between text or line art option. The text file is smaller and the text can be edited. The line art file is larger and is preferred if you want the exact representation of the alignment as it's displayed in JalView. The alignment can also be saved as an SVG file. This high quality scalar vector graphic file supports animation and interactivity. The window can be saved as an HTML file. This preserves all the colors, fonts, additional annotation and URL links. The image can then be viewed in a web browser. The sequence alignment can be saved as a BioJS file and then viewed in the BioJS browser-based multiple sequence alignment viewer. The alignment view can be printed by going to the File drop-down menu and selecting Print. Additional data such as annotations and features can be saved to file or output to text box. The data can be saved in either a JavaView annotation format or as a spreadsheet. Trees can be saved as an image or a Newark tree file, printed or output to the text box and then saved. The views of the 3D structure can be saved as an image or a PDB file. Alternatively, the data can be output to a sequence mapping text box and then saved. Principal component analysis scatter plots can be saved as an image or printed. The matrix data resulting from a principal component analysis and the coordinates can be output into a new window allowing further analysis. For more information about JavaView, please look at our other training videos by going to www.jarview.org. Goodbye.